morning everybody and welcome to Vine Tots virtual session number 26. Goodness me, uh, shall we get tapping and sing the hello song together? So you tap your knees and I'm going to tap my shoulders. Let's sing hello together, let's sing hello together, let's sing hello together. We're glad you joined us today. Hello. Hello everybody. <clears throat> Here we are again with another story about Jesus. And Jesus um, obviously went to the temple a lot, which we would now call a church. So he used to go in the temple to pray to God, who is his father. On this particular day, he was at the temple in Jerusalem and he was just sitting and watching people going by and people stopping to pray and people would give their money to help spread the word of God to other people and to help with the poor people in the neighbourhood who were struggling and couldn't work or couldn't earn any money and he was watching people dropping their money into the collection box and there were well there were rich people and there were poor people um as there are these days so he was watching at one particular point and a rich man came by and you could tell he was rich because of his his clothes and he put lots of money in the box and everybody was impressed oh look at him oh my word he's an important man he's a rich man he's given lots of money to god's work hooray oh my word but then there was a poor lady came in and you could see that she was poor because of her dress. Um, you could see that she she probably struggled most days to get enough food and possibly because she was a woman, um, she couldn't work. So she relied on her family to help her possibly. We don't know much about her. But she came and she put two little coins in the box. And Jesus watched her and he was talking to his disciples and he said to them, do you realise that woman gave more than the rich man with all his coins that he threw in? And they couldn't quite understand what he meant because obviously that lady didn't give more. She gave a lot less. But she gave everything that she had. And that meant a lot more than the rich man who threw all his coins in there. But he had so many coins that he didn't miss those few. And he was a good man by, by doing that. But the lady, Jesus said the lady gave more in a way because she gave everything. There we go. That's another story. See you again soon. God bless. Bye bye. Hello everybody, good to see you and today we haven't really got a craft for you to make, it's something for you to do with mummy and make. Would you like to see what's under here? I wonder if you can guess what this might be. Careful, what do you think that is? Did you guess right? Milk? What are we going to make with some milk? Do you think we're going to make a drink? 
Shake your head. No, we have potatoes and butter and cheese, yummy cheese. And we're gonna peel the potatoes and put them in the saucepan. And when we've got them all peeled and washed, we're gonna put them on the stove to boil. So we'll take the potatoes out of the way. And then we're gonna bring in our dish. And now our potatoes are all ready and done. Well, I haven't told you what we're going to make, have I? We're going to make cheesy potatoes. Did you guess? So now they're all done. And we get the masher. And we mash and mash and mash. And so they're lovely and soft. And then we pour in some milk to make them even more softer. And take off the lid of the butter and put some butter in. We mix that all up again and then we keep the cheese in and then when the cheese is in oh it's yummy and then we're going to take all of the mashed potato and put it in there and then we're going to sprinkle the cheese all over the potato and you see it looks yummy and then we're going to put it in the oven to cook. And it won't take, or you can even put it under the grill and make it until it's all lovely and brown and the butter, the cheese is all melted. So now we're going to put all of that out of the way. Do you think you'll be able to make that? I think so. And if you've never made it before, you will say it's yummy, yummy in your tummy. And now we're going to think about the story that Val told us. And what is this? That's right, a purse. And that little lady had a purse. There's nothing in that bit. Well, under the zip. Can't feel anything in there. Tip it up. Shake your head. It's empty. And that little lady all her money away, didn't she? Now, I believe that that little lady knew Jesus and she knew her Bible. And in the Bible it says, God loves a cheerful giver. And it also says, Jesus said he is the shepherd. Do you remember the story with the sheep? The lost little lamb got lost and Jesus went to find it. Well, Jesus tells us he will look after us like the good shepherd. So that little went, lady went off home and when she got home, this is what she found on her doorstep. Oh, it's heavy. Should we have a look and see what she found in it? She looked for the label to see who it is from. Put it there. Let's open the bag and see what she's got. You tell me what it is. Milk, well done. And what's this? Cheese. And butter. Oh, and goodness me. She's got lots and lots and lots of potatoes. What did we make? We made cheesy potatoes. And that's just what that little lady made, I believe. Now, although the little lady didn't know who had put the bag of goodies on her doorstep, Jesus did know. And how do we think he knew? Because Jesus knows everything. And he knew that little lady would be hungry, didn't he? But he saved the day and gave her all that food. So I think that is 
a thumbs up, don't you? Can you put thumbs up? Well done. And well done you for guessing all the things that was in the bag. And if you make cheesy potato with your mummy or your nanny or whatever you make it with, I hope you enjoy it. Because that's one of my favourite ways of having potato, is having cheese in it. So bye-bye and see you another day. Thank you so much, Kathleen and Val. And uh, for our songs today, I thought I would pull out the old song sack. Listen, it's all full up. How many of you can remember the song sack, I wonder? It's been such a long time since we actually met together, hasn't it? Maybe some of you can, I don't know. So shall I have a little delve and see what I can find and we'll just sing one song to finish today's session off. So what have I got? Are you ready? Are you ready? It's the bunny. Shall we sing Sleeping Bunnies? So at home, can you lay down on the floor or lay down on your sofa or lay down somewhere and pretend? Should we put this bunny to sleep and pretend to go to sleep and we'll sing Sleeping Bunnies together? Are you ready? Have you got your eyes closed? Close your eyes. Here goes. See the little bunny sleeping till it's nearly noon. Shall we try and wake them with a merry tune? Oh, so still, are they ill? Wake up soon. <gasps> wake up, little bunnies, wake up! Are you ready? Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop little bunnies, hop, 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 hop little bunnies, hop and stop. Well done everybody, I'm sure you were fabulous. And now shall we sing the goodbye song? And we're going to have a week off, aren't we? And uh, we'll see you next time. So tap away, here goes. Let's sing goodbye together, let's sing goodbye together, let's sing goodbye together. We're glad you joined us today. Have a great week, everyone. Bye.